Right folks, this is a little bonus. I've come back to do a little bit more near the Bosington Hill area, which I didn't finish last time. The castle and the Iron Age 4 and um, Lady Eckland's hut in the woods somewhere, which I couldn't find because I was, I was short of time, believe it or not. So we got um, Selway, Selworthy Beacon up, up there. We got the Brist Bristol Channel, there's Bosington Hill, the Lynch Coombe pathways as well that go round it. There's the um, hills over to Culbone, um, which I walk through those woods, if you remember as well, around those peaks sticking out there. I'd walked all through this wood here as well, back to Porlock, to Porlock where down there. That was day four. This is an extra day. I've come back. I've come back on purpose to see if I can find these other features. I'm just going to go over to the plaque again. But here we are, we're parked up. This is me and Alberta. And we're parked up here. It's a bit windy and blowy. I've put a small windshield on at the moment. Um, I just assume if there's just there's a sort of yacht thing out there. Looks like it's anchored. NTK, yeah. Yes, anchored out there. It hasn't moved for ages. It might be a fishing vessel. So there we've got it, folks. There's the, the hills. Beautiful hills over to Colbone. That I walked through that wood there. The year nor forest or wood. Um... Right, so it is a bit blowy. I'm going to go over to the post box now. Just to read some more instructions. So there's Alberta. Look. And right over in the distance, that hill right over there is Dungree Beacon. That I was on in the beginning of September, I climbed up that. Since I've been up that, I've done a lot of exploring, mainly over this side. So I don't know what today's events will hold, exactly. Somebody's placed a few flowers there, look for somebody. Somebody who'd like this place. It's a popular place. I've seen some really big camper vans down here when I came last time. Right, Washington Hill. Right, over and out a minute.